Uh, I'm a plant breeder that uh, develops new varieties of winter wheat for farmers in Western Canada. The way we look at it is we divide it up into three areas, uh, agronomic characteristics, disease resistance, and end use quality. All three of those components need to have favorable characteristics uh, so that uh, you develop a plant that uh, a farmer will want to grow. I've been able to increase yields quite substantially. We've been able to uh, uh, adapt the crop so that uh, farmers not only grow it under dry land, but also grow it under irrigation, uh, under, of course, higher moisture conditions. And uh, we've been able to substantially increase the amount of disease resistance that the crop has. In the past, winter wheat really could only be grown successfully in southern Alberta, uh, amongst the prairie provinces. And so, uh, naturally, that was where breeding was taking place. What Alberta does for me now is that because we do have a milder environment in southern Alberta, it allows me to look at germplasm or lines from around the world of winter wheat that may not survive in other areas of Canada, but in fact do survive in Lethbridge. So I can look at those genetic packages and determine whether or not it would be something that I would want to incorporate into my program. Well, I would say one of the major challenges is that plant breeding is uh, a very long-term endeavor. From the time I make a cross to the time uh, it's in farmers' hands is literally about 15 years. And so I constantly need to be anticipating what the needs uh, of the farmer and of what the end use processor is going to be. One of the other things is, of course, we are seeing changes in the environment. And so those are also things that we have to anticipate. From the standpoint of funding support, there have been a lot of uh, different supporters. Uh, of course, uh, Agriculture and Agri-Food Canada, who I work for, uh, the Government of Canada, is uh, my major supporter. And of course, that means it's, it's really the taxpayers of Canada. Farmer support has been absolutely crucial uh, to the work that I do. As well, I've had funds from... Uh, the Alberta Crop Industry Diversification Fund. In Western Canada, we have a class of wheat called Canada Western Red Spring. It's the premium quality wheat uh, that we produce in Canada, and it's recognized as such around the world. Uh, one of the things I'd like to do is to uh, incorporate that type of quality into the winter wheat that I develop so that farmers can receive the same types of prices uh, for their winter wheat as what uh, people growing this premium quality spring wheat would be able to expect. I would say I, I, I'm absolutely honored to be an Aztec finalist, uh, certainly surprised, but uh, yeah, it's, it's a great honor and uh, I hope, you know, I hope I'm truly worthy of, of the honor.